full moon tonight. Is it? So um, beware. It's actually on the calendar for tomorrow, but I've learned, and I will share this information with you. What does that mean when, when someone I'm gonna, says I'm going to share something with you about the full moon. If it says on the calendar that the mind. full moon is tomorrow, April 9th, quite frequently what happens is the full moon happens on April 9th like at 3 a.m. or 2 a.m., so it's technically really tonight, because if you wait till tomorrow night, it's already done. All right. You know what I'm saying? Right. So like tonight, I would call full it full full visibility moon. is at three in the morning. You're Possibly, saying. I didn't oh. look at the time. Oh, I, I just see. see on the calendar. Oh. However, I was told by someone, and you know, whatever it 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 definitely has not made a let me ask you something. anything but a good when, thing in my life. When does tomorrow morning start for you? When I wake up, you mean? Is that, what, is that when it starts? Yeah, I don't up? count it like it's nighttime. Right. So in other words, at 12, like... I still count it Wednesday night. and 1 second a.m. It's still is Wednesday not, night not to me. I see. I mean, it is, technically. Right. I don't like being that technical. Yeah, Come I got gotcha. you. I don't like that. I got gotcha. you. But um, what you do on a full moon, though, I've been told... Why, do pe- why, does this, why does the full moon supposed to stir these feelings or... Things like in Wolfman? people's lives and stuff like that. Why does that happen? I just think it's the way it happens. It just gives energy. It just creates energy. It's a monthly cycle, just like a woman. Our cycles definitely change throughout the month. It does. So lunar, I don't know, Is the, wo- the moon is woman and the sun is male. Is that it? One or the other. Anyhow. I'm not an ex-hippie, so I really don't know. I'm not uh, up on all that type I, of I stuff. I love hippies. You know? Hippies are... I always loved hippies. Yeah. I love hippies so much. Hippies are a big facade. Well, when I was a little kid... You know what hippies are? They're, they're people who couldn't make it as punkers. They were pre-punk. They, they, there was no punk at that time. The hippies were a definite, you know, movement. And when I was... Hippies little, were spoiled rich kids, okay? Who all couldn't, of them? Who couldn't, Every single solitary who, who, who one? Who bought their way out of the draft, all right? And instead of going into the army, all right, they sat on college campuses... And paraded through the, the streets and parks and protested against the war. That's what, that's all hippies were. Um, you think there were hippies in Harlem? Hippies we're going to cut for a commercial right now because um, Harlem is true to my heart. Never trust a hippie. Oh, right? my God. Remember wait, that. wait, Never wait. ever trust a hippie. Oh, please. Come yeah, on. Never. true. Well, they used to say never trust anyone over 25. That's so. what you do when you see it. I'm just joking. No, punks used to say that. Never yeah. trust anyone over 25. So, like, you know. I don't know. When I was a little kid, I used to beg my mother to take me to the village to see the hippies. And <laughs> I would beg her. I'd be like, Mommy, please, can we go see the hippies? We got to cut, and I'll tell you about it when we come back. All right. Ruby's World. Mwah.